dear friends, it is Srinivasan who is having more than 30 years experiences in this construction industries, trying to give you a small presentation on advantages and limitations of aluminium form work. How many of you aware of how many types of form works in aluminium has been manufactured, known as My1, S form, Ichita, Mini, and there is so many manufacturer who is making the aluminium form work. Did you are aware of what are the limitations and advantages of this form works? I am trying to explain you according to my knowledge what is about it. Advantages Light in weight and easy to handle, easy to assemble, safety to built in a system, semi skill labors, force is more than enough. It gives good labor productivity 6 to 8 square meter per man day. Components are durable and they can be used several times without sacrificing the quality of correctness and dimensions and surfaces. More seismic resistance because it is a box type construction. Lesser number of joints thereby reducing the leakages and enhancing the durable structure. Advantages again, lightweight and easy to handle, easy to assemble, inbuilt system, semi skill labor force is more than enough. Higher carpet area, due to the shear walls, the walls are thin, hence the carpet area is getting increased. Negligible maintenance, strong built up of concrete needs no maintenance. Simplified foundation design due to consistent load distribution. The natural density of the concrete wall result in better sound transmission coefficient. Speedy in give construction gives required accuracy. Yields monolithic construction, no plastering is needed. Simple interlocking systems. Accommodates architecture features. Gives good surface and smooth quality finish. The in-situ construction of all walls and partition reduces the requirement for follow-up on wet trades. Assembly-like production, pace-wise completion in desired groups of a building, early utilization of the building. Lightweight. You can see from the images, it can be it has been handled by very few people. Weight is 25 kgs per square meter. Withstand pressure of 8 tons per square meter. See how the people are handling it. Very easy to handle it off. Semi skilled labor is more than enough. You can see that without a carpenter, also we are erecting the wall. Even this uh, images will show you how the semi skilled laborers are erecting the wall panels. Usable to 250 times after regular refurbishment. If you maintain it properly, it can be give you a minimum of 250 repetitions. Monolithic construction, because as it is a box type construction, it is a monolithic. It is a slabs, walls, columns, beams are a casters simultaneously. You can see these images, how these things have been getting carried out. This is the type of a walls. This is the type of a beams which has been erected. Lift core walls, how it has been constructed. Staircase walls, how it has been constructed. These images will be self explanatory Simple interlocking system. You can see how the interlocking has been arranged. It's like a just like it with a tie with the pins. These images will explain you how you can do the architectural features also with the aluminum. Types of various type of architectural features can be done with the aluminum form. Quality finish. See how neat and clean quality finish you are getting it after the 
MNE can be fixed with the reinforcements, that is, uh, mechanical and electrical systems can be fixed along with the reinforcement. These images will show you how it has been fixed. Here you can see that how this conduits has been laid down. Cutouts in slabs. Whenever you want to have a cutout in the slabs, a small box is more than enough, which meets the requirement. This is the way we fix our cutouts in our form of shuttering. Doors and windows. It has to be pre-planned, so accordingly you can see that the doors and panels have been fixed, side by the reinforcement, which is the wall. After the shuttering has been removed, these openings will be made to accurate so that you can make a customized door materials and uh, timber i am giving a comparison between timber and plywood and all aluminium durability 20 times whereas aluminium it is 120 to 150 times wastages in timber and plywood it is definitely yes in aluminium no quality it is subject to the workmanship whereas in aluminium even with the semi unskilled laborers you can get a good finish Labor required highly skilled, here you require unskilled laborers. Flexibility in timber and plywood is more, whereas in aluminium it is less, because as it is a fractured in the manufacturing. Cost is 300 to 450 rupees per square meter, both are same, but you have to check today's market prices. Limitations in the aluminium form. High initial investment cost. This is a major factor. Every builders, you know, not intend to invest a lot of money in the aluminum form box. More number of a components because it will have a wall panel, beam panels, slab panels, lintel panels. There is many more numbers will be there. Prime area of application. Generally, it can be used in a mass housing because where it has been given a a lot of reputations more and the cost has been recovered very easily. High repair cost if it has been damaged. Probably it will lead to a theft or something like that. So you have to be very careful in uh, uh, storing the material. Segregation and staking requires uh, more spaces whereas in plywood it doesn't require. Since the material are project specific only some panels and components shall be used for some other projects. In a plywood, you can beam sizes can be used, a column sizes and etc. etc. after cutting and everything, whereas in aluminium form work it is not possible. Thank you for watching this presentation. If you like this presentation, kindly like and share, which will motivate me to give a further more good presentation. In case of any queries, do not hesitate to write to me. The response shall be at the earliest. You can contact me at civilconclave at the rate of gmail.com or at my telegram group which is known as All Serenity Telegram Groups. The link has been shown below. Thank you for watching again. Thanks once again for watching.